The People's Democratic Party in Lagos State has urged the Independent National Electoral Commission to reverse its decision in declaring the House of Representatives election held in a joint local government area inconclusive. They want the Commission to immediately declare results of the election. The party's candidate, Tajuddin Adekunle Obasa, stated these while addressing journalists. He argued that despite irregularities in the process and malpractices carried out by the All Progressives Congress, he still garnered more votes than his opponents. The INEC uh, is being biased as an umpire. An umpire must play a rightful way. And an umpire, again, must be straightforward in everything doing at all, not to be biased at the result. Uh, the case study of my own local government, which I've just read out, and uh, we all know that the election was uh, held. But in a situation whereby the INEC official later said the election was not held, some voting point must be cancelled and some um, uh, units also must be cancelled. So why they must give us the reason? That's one. Then two, in a situation whereby there is a margin, there is a record between the uh, and um, a candidate contested, and INEC read out the margin, and without no excuse, now saying there was an inconclusive in just five polling units out of about 582 polling units. Earlier, supporters of the PDP House of Representatives candidate staged a protest to the Independent National Electoral Commission in Lagos to contest the commission's decision. A spokesperson of the demonstrators, while speaking to journalists, described INEC's decision as one tantamount to ignite in crisis. They accused INEC of double standards, wondering why the exercise which produced winners of presidential and senatorial seats was adjudged to be hitch free, except for that of the House of Representatives. Our own candidate. Honorable Taji Dino Basa, Adekule Obasa, aka any affair, scored the total number of 28,601 28, in that election. This closet driver, who is from the other party, scored 25,445. I mean, five, four, five, 545. And unfor to, to be surprised was very, very unfortunate that INEC, who we respect so much, so in, we place them in a very high esteem, could just come at the blue and tell us that uh, the, the election is somehow, that somebody somewhere will be the one to tell us what to be the outcome. How can somebody something be like that? The election is expected to be announced at the polling center, also at the collection center, also at the LGA collection center. And the most unfortunate thing is that the LGA, at the LGA collection center, the election of the Senate was announced. There was no problem. The same election that produced the Senate is the same election that produced the presidential election. And all those results were announced and taken by INEC. Then what is heading our own of House of Representatives in Ojo? We want to ask INEC, what is delaying our mandate? Who is there delaying our mandate? Why are they delaying our mandate? And for what purpose are they delaying our mandate? Well, uh, they say they're going to do uh, the run in a uh, five pulling booth. And the, the, the total calculation of that five pulling booth is under 3,000 that get PVC there. So I don't know why they, they cannot declare us since on Saturday. So that's why we are here today. And we are back, we are peaceful maker, we are peaceful local government. So that's why we don't want to cause trouble in the local government.